Good morning, everybody. Welcome to winter day one. Fortune teller says good humor for the spirits. It's something. Yeah, it's really not that important to check the weather in winter because it's kind of irrelevant. Like, whatever happens, happens. But look at this. Look how beautiful it is. Go ahead and grab our gold bars here and put them away. Get some more going. Ooh, that fire sound was really epic there just now. It was like, like that sound you hear in music sometimes. Probably fun to send you a letter. I don't really know what to write, though. Here, I've enclosed a treat for you. Don't tell anyone, but I snagged this from the back room of Jojo Mart ages ago. Okay, see you soon. Pepper Poppers, cool! So, Pepper Poppers give you plus one speed. And they're actually not too hard to make, either. All of this is peppers and cheese. So, um... I guess I'll keep it on me, although I don't... No, actually... I'll just put it away for now. Um... Man, I got a lot of eggs in here. Oh, let's see. Alright, so animals. Animals are always going to be inside in the winter because they don't like that cold, let me tell you. I can't say I blame them either. Hey, we have a white chicken, though. I guess they start out yellow and then they turn white. And I'm not going to say any more about that. I'm not sure what we're looking at as far as hay supplies, but it must be pretty good right now, because we were just at 200 right around the end of fall. So it might be like 200 even right now. I don't really know. Alright. You guys happy? Got your heater all set up. Still not ready to milk yet. They'll definitely be bigger than that when they are ready. So, so the only thing we really have to water is the dog. Yeah, he doesn't mind. Now, you're gonna be getting a lot of use out of your hoe this particular time of year, because you can actually hoe... Oh, well, not right there, but... Not really sprinklers. I'll just leave the sprinklers out here for now, because I'm not gonna be able to do anything with them anyway. So, um... Our two biggest goals for this winter are... Get the pickaxe to Iridium, get watering can to Iridium, now, if we go ahead and get the pickaxe to Iridium, that'll make the gathering of Iridium in general go by faster, and since we have the Iridium bars to do it, and the money, I think that's going to be our first move here. It's only 8.30 though, so well, we'll be over there by 9, or it'll be 9 by the time we get there. Hopefully. Maybe not. It's okay. Let's go over here. Oh, by the way, this is a holly. If you look a little further down, you might see Ross somewhere in here. <laughs> Let's see what we got. I don't think winter is really, like, has any, like, special fish that you can get, because we've already finished the fish tank, so... Whatever you catch in winter is probably just going to be kind of an assortment of things that you found throughout the year. I don't really know. Oh, I should have brought a topaz for you, buddy. Eh, it's okay. It's not gonna matter. Let's see what's in the shop. Same thing as usual. Okay. Well, I can't believe I'm doing this, but... Boom. I almost never... I, I think there's only one playthrough where I ever got to Iridium on anything. But we're getting it now. And it's gonna be good. Just keep in mind, though, that that means we won't be able to mine pretty much for this entire video. Just a little... Yeah, it's unfortunate, but what are you going to do? It's the price you pay for being successful. I'd really like to upgrade the hoe, too. I'd like to... I mean, we will get around to it, and that's really the only other thing besides the axe, which has one more step itself, but I don't care too much about the axe, because it's already the gold axe. It's already really good. So winter is usually a good time to just build relationships with people. I do have a couple of artifacts in here, don't I? Well, I have one. I still have a beer in here, I want to tell ya. Oh, hey, Pam. You heading into work? Well, I can't think of a better reason to drink up than that. Yeah. Have a cluckety-cluck-cluck -cluck day, Hugo. I want to tell ya. So, in doing this doesn't actually really take that long. 
just a quick trip around town and say hi to everybody. Work on your relationships. Also, I'd like to check birthdays. Because it's gonna be really important. Such a nice gift. Yes, indeed it is. Do do do. -do. All right. Well, today is Krobus's birthday. What do you? Wouldn't you know it? Um. All right. We're gonna have to get something for him then, aren't we? Green algae for a calzone I'm making. Lewis will be thankful. 45G though. I don't know if that's even worth it. Okay. So I guess Krobus likes pumpkins. Now, once again, I'm thinking about this, and I'm thinking, well, maybe I can trust my future self to think of it before the day is out. But no, never trust your future self. Never do it. I've learned my lesson one too many times from that. Unfortunately, it's a ways to go to get to my pumpkins, but I do have them. Oh, look at this. Maybe it's a good thing I stopped by here. So I'm just gonna grab a pumpkin. It's gonna have to be a gold star, because we want to maximize here. And also... Let's get all this stuff that's taking, like, one slot in here. And just get rid of it. Except for the plum, I'm gonna hang on to that. Alright, salmonberry, salmonberry. Blackberry, blackberry, blackberry. Grape, grape, grape. There's two more over here, so we'll go ahead and... That and that. There we go, now they're all filled up. So this'll be, like, a pretty decent source of income throughout the winter, but there are other ways to make money in the winter, and we'll get into that. I must have gotten confused or something and thought that I was at my selling chest. <laughs> I don't know. That was pretty dumb. It's pretty dumb beyond to 2D thrust here. Alright, while we're at it. So we can grab the gold bars while we're here so we can throw those in too. And... Alright, we're actually out of gold. I don't believe it. We actually used it all up. Let's go ahead and craft this iridium bar here. Oh, I should put the coal away, too. Oh. Alright, now. Where are we headed? Where's the quickest way to get there? Probably just in town. Boy, look at the size of that energy bar. That is nuts. I don't even know what I've used energy on yet today. Yeah, but you'll consistently find it being earlier in the day than you think it is. Because... Uh oh got no salad for you. Got no class, man. I got nothing for any of you guys. I really gotta work on that. Okay, so there's nothing in there. And since it's earlier, people are probably gonna be around different places than usual. Not to mention it's a different season, so that's definitely gonna change it up. Saloon, I ain't messing with you. Why don't we do first things first here, just to make double sure that we don't miss it. Horsey, I'm just gonna leave you right there. I don't know how the temperature is down here. I imagine it couldn't be too bad. I'd like to think that it's actually still like warm down here. A oh, birthday gift, that's very kind of you, I love it. I'm gonna grab some more solar essences from you here, buddy. Uh oh, that's all I can afford. Holy crap. I can't sell anything here. Alright, well. I wanna get those solar essences up, because I do have two iridium bars, I can make an iridium band out of it now. So, all I lack is the solar essences. I guess if I really wanted to, I could just go to the mines and get the rest of them. But that would entail going through the... Well, I can't do that now, because I don't have my pickaxe on me, but... So it's not even a question, really. We're just not doing it, that's all. Okay, well, I don't have anything for George, so... Do I? I don't have a leak in here. Oh, Pam and Penny. Oh, look, I see a... Oh, hi, Penny. Um... Got an emerald for you. There you go. I like Penny a lot too. She's a she's a cutie. Anyway, see those bubbles rising up from the water? We haven't seen that yet, I think, at all in this playthrough. But if you can manage to land on it, you get a bite right away. Well, fishing is not a bad thing to do in winter. I mean, it's wow. Catching a lot of junk out here, aren't we? You'll know you hit the bubbles because you'll see like a little blue sparkles come out from your bobber when it hits the water. So yeah. yeah the longest you'll ever have to wait is probably <laughs> two seconds or something. 
Yep, no problem. Back over here and see how many. Oh, that was a little too far there. Uh oh, well, we got something a little different here. Something a little feisty. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Aw, oh, it's just a tiger trout. How often do you get this, these little spots like this? It's the first time we've seen one. Or maybe the second time. We might have seen one before and I couldn't reach it or something. Because sometimes you'll see one and you just can't reach it. You know. If you see one that's just like a little bit out of the way, you can actually cast to the left or right by pressing left or right as you cast. See that? See how I kind of cast to the right there? Anyway, you can do that. That is a thing that you can do. I just repeated myself. Oh well. So a couple of spots that might be worth looking at as far as hoeing or hoeing or whatever. Oh, Alex, I, man, I'm only running into the weird people. It's a Robin's yard. This would be one spot. Boom. And this is a way that you can at least spend your energy in winter. Because there's not a lot of other ways to spend it. You can fish, and you can mine. But now that you're not watering your crops every morning, it's kind of like, well, I got all this energy, what do I do with it? Robin, I don't have hardwood, I don't have spaghetti. Bam! This is not a very well-planned gifting trip, was it? I suppose, if I wanted to, I could drop off the holly, or I could at least look for the rest of winter foraging. In fact, what happens when I get all of it? Or am I going to get all of it? Winter foraging, I already have two of them. I can eat a snow yam and a crocus. Okay, well, I haven't seen either of those yet. Those will turn up, though. I said they should just be sitting around. Let me see, does it show you what... Oh my god, no, shoot. I got my hopes up there. So that is for the bridge repair. Which is not the worst thing in the world, but... Yeah, you can just come out here. She doesn't mind. She just walked right by. She didn't seem to care at all. It's hacking up her yard over here. I guess people are pretty easy going in Stardew Valley. Huh? Who would have thought? Who would have guessed? I guess we can look inside and see if anybody's in here. And Demetrius is in here. First I thought that was Sebastian, but... No. There you go, ice cream in the winter, baby. Even in the winter, he loves it. Where does that put him on our list? Is he still at the top? He's still at the top, man. Only, only George is right behind him. So we just hit up George on his birthday. Uh-oh. Uh oh, no, I wasn't I wasn't about to come to your room. Don't no 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 no. I wasn't I wasn't standing outside your door. I promise. Alright, go ahead. Move your butt. Thank you. Beat you to the door. <laughs> Alright, so another place that you can go... Wait a minute, can you do it here? It seems like it looks like you can do it here. Yeah, I guess you can. Ah, there's one. Oh man, I'm starting to see some stuff here. I'm pretty sure that luck actually plays into this, too. Like, if you have good luck, you find more stuff out here. So, and being that today is a neutral day, I'm actually pretty impressed with what I'm seeing here. So most of the stuff that I'm finding here, I'm probably just going to sell. You can make you know, some pretty decent money just by selling the stuff you find here. You could plant it, but, like, you know, this is my vacation from having to do that, you know, my vacation from having to water my plants. Those were worms right there. You definitely see more of those out here. Like, you see two of them right here. So that's always guaranteed to drop something. And this is another nice big area, too, where you can actually find stuff. Snow yams, man. If you could drop that crocus for me, I'd be very happy. Crocus is more along the lines of something you would just see sitting out, though. Not something you would dig up. 
at least in my experience, it's more often that some it's something that you just see sitting out. Wow. Three drops from that. I mean, one of them was the worm, but still. This becomes a lot more lucrative if you have the gold or iridium hoe, obviously, but... But you do well enough just with the silver one, really. Thank goodness there's no weapon durability in this game. <laughs> well, I tell you, you'd be going through it in a hurry, wouldn't you? Damn, look at him go. So I could save the winter roots for making roots flatters. But I don't know. Because you can't make them if you don't have the cave cod anyway to go with it. So, might as well just sell them. But we'll just get a quick look here and see, like, how much money we make. There's not really anything that you need to save them for, like, to make. So once again, you could plant them, I guess. Or, like, put them in the seed maker, I guess, or something. And then grow them. But I just don't believe in it, man. That would be like doing homework on your summer vacation. In this game, you get the winter vacation. It don't matter how cold it is, you don't feel it, so... Let me take a look in here and see, we got another plum. Not bad, not bad at all. Just uh, cut right through the yard here. Doesn't even matter if we leave the gates open, because the animals won't go outside. So we're good on that. Yeah, so I was about to drop off the snowy am in the gift chest, but I'm gonna, like I said before, I'm going to sell them. Uh, nobody, Snowy Am is basically a mediocre gift for almost everybody. Some people hate it. Leah and Linus like it. But that's the only two that you would ever get any real points off of it from. But we have other stuff we can give them. Green Algae, let me... Who was that that wanted that? Green Algae, Lewis. Oh, I should have done that when I had the chicken. Well, maybe tomorrow. I'll keep it on them. I'm gonna keep it on you just in case. Actually, Fish could probably just go over here. So I know I said before I didn't really need... You know, the quality fertilizer, because it's winter. But no reason not to put stuff away for it, you know, for next year. Even though I can't help but think these would really make some good money. There are other ways to make money, though, dude. Don't be so one-track minded. Yeah, there's really no reason to hang on to the holly. There's no recipes or anything that take it. Everybody hates it except for Linus, so you might know, put it away. Clay we're keeping. That we're definitely keeping. Oh, diamond. I never the diamond back away. Here. Alright. And the iridium bar goes in here. Eggs go in here. As does the plum. And then clay. Oop. Finally clay goes in here. Well, that's our first day of winter right there. Get some wine. Might as well go and start digging into the pumpkins. It's better to have the money early. I mean, call JG Wentworth, you know? So we need our cash now. So that's not bad for foraging right there. The snow yams sell for 100 each. Winter roots for 100 and... Or, it looks like... Looks like maybe 70. Well, if they were 50, I would've gotten 900. So we got 360 more. 18 times 20 is 360. 50 plus 20. So 70, yeah, 70 each. Did you see how I did that there just now? It's 5,000, man. You can still make money in winter, and this is without, you know, doing any mining at all. The foraging is basically free, and there's no danger of having to fight monsters while you're out. So, weather, you know. I mean, occasionally it'll snow, that's about all it'll do. And, uh, let's see. Good humor again. I guess the spirits like winter or something, don't they? Alright, let's get in here. Let's love on our chickens here. Get out and get. get, get, get. Oh, this void egg's not gonna be able to hatch until I upgrade the coop. So, but I need 20,000 gold to do that, so. Oh, I love how that when that base kicks in, man. Yeah. Alright, well, we're done with the animals. 7.20 a.m. and we're done. A little challenge for you, catch me a squid. You can fish them from the ocean at night. They only show up in the winter, though. Oh. Well, we haven't done that much for Willie. Maybe we could get out there. Since we don't have our pickaxe today anyway. Alright, well, 
since we have such a long day, I figure we can go ahead and swing by the wizard's place today. So you can see how different things look down here. You know what? Hey, hang on a second. Let me check. Check over here by the... I'm just looking for that crocus. That's all I want. If I can get that, I'd be pretty happy. It's amazing how different things look out here, though. I mean, I guess it's not that amazing. I mean, anyone who's seen winter in real life. Well, the thing, though, is if you live somewhere where it doesn't snow, you, know, you'd, you would rarely get to see something like this. I know when I lived in Georgia, it was definitely pretty exciting when it snowed. See, very rare. You saw it, like, maybe once or twice a year. Well, that's when I lived there. I don't know if it happens at all there now. It's another holly. Have a holly jolly Christmas. That one song where he's like, Ho, ho, the mistletoe. It's like, how can you not want to sing, Ho, ho, the toilet bowl. It's just, anytime somebody says the something, and it makes a sentence out of it, I just have to, you know, follow up with the toilet. The toilet. Because that's not a sentence either. Oh, everything's all far away from each other. The sword is serving me very well. How did I do that before I got that other star drop? <laughs> I'm telling you, it was just a mistake on my part. But hey. I mean, I don't even care about ripping up the hardwood. Just because of how easy it is to get hardwood on the forest farm. I mean, I love the forest farm. I'll tell you what. It's like the greatest farm ever, man. Hey, Mr. Wizard. Hope you're keeping warm in here. Whoop. Yeah, isn't it, though? Yeah, I'm not gonna go start bringing pumpkins to Krobus every day now that I know it's his favorite. Um. Because there's other stuff you can give him. You can give him a diamond, you can give him an iridium bar, although I don't think you would want to do that. Just not at this point. And you can also give him void eggs and void mayonnaise. So, <laughs> go figure. Maybe once that void egg hatches, we can do something with that. But, well, once again, we have to expand. There it is, there it is, we got one. We got the crocus, baby. We got it. Now we need a snow yam. Because I sold all the ones I picked up yesterday. But now that we have both of them, let's go ahead and say howdy. Oh, more cutscenes. I was just about to have a snack. Really? That's basically me three times a day. Let me get something for you. Nice for it. Oh, oh, oh no! <laughs> oh, I dropped an egg on the floor. Oh, what a mess. Oh, you poor soul. What was that sound? Nothing. I just pooped my pants. Oh, an egg! How dare you! This is absolutely terrible. What happened? Sam dropped the snack as he was handing it to me. She'll appreciate his generosity. He's right, that's what happened. Thanks for telling me the truth. It's not such a big deal. Well, of course not. I'm sorry about this, Mom. I'll clean it up. Aw. Thanks, honey. Honey pie. Well, that was funny. Honey, that was funny. Oh, is he playing in here by himself? Oh. No, I don't want to eat that. Do I even have? Well, I guess I don't. Well, never mind then, dude. I guess you're not getting anything. That's what happens when you drop eggs on the floor. I don't see Jody in here. That's weird. Maybe she went somewhere. Alright, well, let's see if Haley and or Emily is home. Haley's home. Let's go ahead and give Haley the third boob here. There you go, third boob. Oh my god, this is my favorite thing. I love the third boob. Okay, so Mr. Mayor, you're still looking for that green algae? I can totally give it to you here. Maybe not so much for the gold, but for the friendship points. He's not here. He might be up at Robin's, I'm not sure. Let's just look around here. Also, gonna go for that squid challenge a little later. Actually, we could drop by the saloon. 
It's still a little early though. Yeah, not much going on in there. All right then. Oh, there's another Harley right there. He actually might be hanging out at Pierre's. He is hanging out at Pierre's, wouldn't you know it? Green algae, dude. Got it for you. Hello, so you saw the notice I posted. Looks perfect. Here's your payment as promised. Yeah, that's something. Whatever. Wait, what was that other one in there? Catch a squid. Oh, yeah, duh. Uh, Pierre, I got nothing for Oh, here we go. Here we go. We haven't seen this yet. Every Tuesday, the girls come over here to work out. And let me tell you something, girls. I'm about to ruin everything that you're doing here. Here's some pancakes. Get fat. Emily. Here's a jade. Actually, that won't do anything. Marty, jumping rope over here. I mean, okay, okay, fine. Here's a diamond. Have at it. Uh, Robin? Finally, Robin, no spaghetti for you, but I'll give you some hardwood. So we're back to giving Robin hardwood again. Just couldn't stay away, man, I tell you. I, I guess at least I should give Caroline something. Well, I do have daffodils, and she does like those, so there you go. Mm-hmm, no problem. I don't want to be that person that comes in and gives a gift to everyone except for you. That happened to me once in the bakery. I've told that story before. As someone who quit, come back, and left flowers for everybody, you know. I mean, not that I desperately wanted a flower or anything, but it's beside the point. The point is they acknowledged everyone except for me, which is... You know, and I, I, how do you say that without sounding like you're pity partying, you know? But it happened, you know, and it's like, how else am I supposed to interpret that? I'm supposed to interpret it as that I'm invisible, or that I'm... Well, I just never contributed to the conversation, you know, so that's probably why. How's it going, Abigail? You'll acknowledge my existence, won't you? If I give you something nice? Yeah, I thought so. But that's why I really wanted to get popular on YouTube. It's, it's like my way of sticking it to them, saying, Hey, you didn't notice me before. Maybe you do now. No, don't eat it right in front of him. You're giving this to me. Hell yeah. I'm not going to go in there. Well, do I have enough friendship with Sebastian to get in his room yet? I probably don't. I haven't been... Well, I get two hearts with him. Let me see. Because if I can get into his room, it'd be really easy to just start gifting him regularly. Oh, he's not even in there. Okay, he's probably out doing the 420 thing again. It sucks doing the 420 thing in winter. I remember when I had to... Oh, look at that, there's the thing. The little thing where it shines. You know, it's gone now. Let's go ahead and start looking for that snow yam, how about it? In fact, I'll start right here. It won't take us long to find one. Well, I didn't check the spirits, though. But you know what? Screw the spirits, man. Well, judging by what I've seen so far, I'd have to guess they must be displeased today. But it doesn't mean we'll find nothing. It just means we may have to look a little harder. There we go. Let's go ahead and get this done. Nope. I think I glitched out the horse there. He couldn't hear his footsteps. So to run down to the community center and turn these in, because that'll complete not only a bundle, but a complete set of bundles. And that'll unlock the quarry. So no reason not to. What is it about winter that's just so relaxing, you know? I mean, it doesn't feel good or anything, but oops, this is the wrong one. Oh, that creaking sound. Alright, snowy and go. Crocus, finish them off. And winter seeds, which we'll probably just sell. Because I'm not doing any watering. I'm not doing it. So many wonderful bundles. Thank you, thank you. Oh, this room is so adorable. A little spindle over there, toy table, globe, firewood, typewriter, a little art, a little art set over here. Oh, it's just so nice. And that gives us four of the six stars. Oh, hey, the, did, did the windows change? Huh. 
I never even noticed that before. Something changed up there. Alright then. Oh, I see those worms over there. Don't think I don't. Alright, well, it's getting pretty close to nighttime, so I guess we can go down and try for that squid. I don't remember how much he said. Jody, I didn't see you earlier. Oh, wait, neither. Yeah, I did. What am I talking about? I made you fat with the pancakes. Yeah, someone made a post on Reddit about Alex. Like, that his name sort of sounds like all eggs. Alex, all eggs. <laughs> sort of. Uh oh, did I. There's my cursor there. There's the Nautilus shell. You can also hold the ground around here, too. But based on what I saw earlier, I'd have to guess that it wouldn't be very fruitful. But look at all the worms, though. They're not technically worms, I guess. They're supposed to be like something else, but. twigs or something. It's worth a look. So we have the muscle rustle here. There was another one off to the left there, an oyster. And I just walked away from it. Anything else over here? This is a poopy castle. You know, when you take wet sand and let it fall through your hand. Poopy castle. Okay, so the, what was that I just picked up that was... was oh, Nautilus shell. Where does that go again? Oh, it went right here in field research. Okay. And I guess that gets me friendship with Demetrius. Not that we so desperately need it, but... But man, we'd have somebody up to eight hearts. That would be kind of a big deal. So, oh man, this is perfect. I'll fish from behind the box here. It casts just the right length so we land on there. Oh, oh, this might be it, too. There it is! Squid! First frickin' try, man! You know what? I should stick around here. If there's bubbles, I mean, we should keep going. So you can get fished so fast here. And other assorted goodies, you know. But, like, if you can get a bite right when you cast... You know, it's like, why not, man? That's a halibut. Totally. Grab the treasure here, whatever it is. There is that one bobber that like, makes treasures appear more often, but it also... Oh my. Uh-oh, we're full. Well, we already have glass shards, so I'm just going to drop those and take the jewelry. What else can we get rid of in here, though? I mean, probably a coral. Well, we can get rid of the seaweed. Here we go. I should have just ate it, I guess, but... <laughs> but man, or oh man, since when has energy been an issue at all? Well, you're not going to be at home. You might be at the pub, though, so we can swing by there and have a look. Hello, horsey. Yoshi. <laughs> horse has been so helpful just for getting around quicker. So any other gifts that we didn't get a chance to give, we get a chance to do it now. Willie, there you are, buddy. You got your squid. Hey, you did it! Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm impressed. Winter's a good time to break out the old fishing rod, isn't it? Yeah, that's nice, I guess. Catch a squid, 800 gold. Holy gee, that's not bad. Glad we did that. I might just put the other squid away for bragging rights or something. And give him away. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. Give it away now, give it away. This sounds very stupid indeed. Also, I have a topaz for Clint here. Let's just probably get rid of it. There we go. And salad for you know who. No problem. Okay, do we have time to swing by the community center? I think we probably do. Thanks to the monstrosity of my horse. 
of those monsters in Final Fantasy X that horse attack you. Those are funny. Those dogs, I mean. There's just something about their animation reminds me of a horse. Horses are funny. I don't know why they're so funny. Alright, where was it? It was field research. And Demetrius? Gotcha, buddy. I got your back. It gives us the recycling machine. I mean, pretty consistent with this. Ca I love how the characters or like the gifts that you get on the bulletin board are consistent with the characters that are up there. It shows that they really put a lot of thought into the game outside of just you know numbers and strategy. You know, there's this. It feels like there's actual people. You know. Let's go ahead and grab some more iron here so we can just be doing something with these furnaces. Plus, they help keep the horse warm. You know. Even though that's not really, it doesn't matter. But, it matters to me! Okay, it matters to you. Some more of those. We don't have time to walk that out to the treasure chest, though, so... Alright. Well, that was actually longer than I expected. Next time on Stardew Valley, we continue winter. Go get our Iridium Axe, and hopefully... And hopefully we have good luck so we can go mining with it. See ya! Oh, hello. Where are we repairing the bridge here, actually? I always forget that, like, <laughs> we have to show that. Not this, but, like, the money at the end, too. Let's see what we made today. Probably not that much. Well, it's not bad. It's a little bit of everything here. The corals, actually, surprisingly a lot there. Yeah, winter seeds were 900, so that was a lot of it there. But, yeah. Okay, then. Now, for real, see ya.